It's your boy D-Rich back at it once again. Before I get started with this video, I need you to smash that like button right now. I'm gonna say it again, smash it right now. What I'm here to talk about today is how to get better at basketball. I have so many of you guys in my DM and you guys are sitting at home wondering, how can I become better at basketball? And me, now that I've been around the basketball game for so many years now, I'm gonna give you my top five ways to become better at basketball. Number one, you guys have to hang around people who are doing better than you. You have to hang around people who are better than you at basketball if you wanna become better. So many of you guys are hanging around people every summer that do the same thing every day and they plan for a local basketball team and they only average about five points in each and every summer and day that you guys hang out, it's time is ticking time is ticking they're not getting any better and you're not getting any better and then you wonder why you're not getting better at basketball it's because you're hanging around people who are not helping you improve even for me i hang around people who are doing better than me financially so guess what that make me want to do it make me want to learn more ways to get more money if you guys want to be better at basketball you have to find people that are better than you work out with them play with them and you will get better you will improve i know you don't want to hang around people who are doing better than you sometimes but hey that's life you got to if you want to improve you got to hang around people who are doing better than you so from this day on find you some guys who put in work and they're doing good each and every year they're improving find a way to work out with them find a way to get in with them no matter what you got to do and guess what you'll see your game improve gradually number two get out the house you know back in the day and i hate to be one of those people because i'm not that old but back in the day we used to get out the house and we used to play we used to go to the perkins pool which is a local basketball court and play each day after school and guess what we would learn new things just by playing now me I'm not the best basketball player in the world. I was decent. Football was more my thing. But guess what? Those guys who stuck with it each and every day that played basketball each and every day, guess what? They got better each and every day just by playing. I know you guys want to play Fortnite. I know you guys want to play Call of Duty. I know you guys want to play 2K My Court. But you have to find time to take your ass to the basketball court and get better i'm telling you just by getting out and playing against different people in the neighborhood it will help you improve your game i'm telling you get out the house and get active on the basketball court if you want to become better number three find a legit trainer so many of you guys are working out with trainers that have you going up and under a seat dribbling a basketball something that you never gonna do in a basketball game and you thinking that that's gonna help you improve this trainer gimmick it's a it's a new trend everybody's a basketball trainer i'm not gonna tell you who or who not to work with but some of these basketball trainers are terrible you have to find you a basketball trainer who is legit and is gonna help you improve your game don't be wasting your time with these trainers who know nothing and have you doing things that you're not going to do in the game. I'm telling you, these basketball trainers that have you run up and down the court with a gallon in the water, then come back and shoot a three. How is that translating to, to basketball? They have you out there doing basketball moves that are not basketball moves, if you get what I mean. Like, it's, it's so insane, like the stuff that I see with some of these basketball trainers. You guys have to find your reliable trainer, work with them, and that will help improve your game. And I, know, and I know some of you guys out there are saying right now, I cannot afford a basketball trainer because my mom is in a tough situation. But if you look down at your feet, you got $450 shoes from StockX, and you got a Supreme hoodie on that costs about $350. And you got jeans that cost $150. That's a couple of months of training right there. And you probably got a PS5 or Xbox Series X. That's a couple months of training right there. And you probably buying V-Bucks for Fortnite or whatever. 
that's a couple months of training right there. So you can find a way to afford a trainer if you really want to and cut out some of the stuff in your life that you really want, but you don't need at the moment. Number four, you have to become a student of the game. YouTube have so many highlights of players from back in the day, even players that play now, become a student of the game. Watch different people and take away different parts of their game and forget the bad stuff they do. You know, you got, it's kind of like they say, you got to shoot the meat and spit out the bone, pause. You got to take the good part from people and leave the bad part alone. So go back and watch some of these old school players, even some new school, high school players that you may like. Take bits and parts of their game and put it into yours. You have to become a student of whatever you want to accomplish. Like me, I'm trying to become a student with this YouTube algorithm. I got to crack this. I got to crack this YouTube algorithm. So I've been trying to do new things. Some of it's not working. Some of it is, but I'm going to keep implementing new things into D Rich TV that can help it improve. I'm becoming a student of this. So you guys have to also become a student of basketball, take away the good and the bad from old school and new players games, because there's so many things that you can look up on YouTube. Now I'm telling you, YouTube is like a encyclopedia for basketball. Everything is on here. So become a student of the game. Try to watch at least 30 minutes of, of one of your favorite players every day. You know, just study it. Just study it and implement it into your game. And I'm telling you, it will help you become better at basketball. And the last, but definitely not least, you have to believe in yourself. You have to be an alpha, okay? I know there's some betas out there in the world just naturally, but when you want to become great, you have to be an alpha on that basketball court to be great. Now, you can be a beta and you can be good. Like Paul George, he's a beta, but he, he he's making millions of dollars. Like betas make millions of dollars too. So I'm not telling you that you definitely, definitely have to be an alpha. But if you want to be an all-time great, you have to be an alpha. But no matter what you are, you have to believe in yourself. It starts in here. You have to believe that you can make it and get it done. I see so many of you guys, you step onto the basketball court and you do not believe in yourself. And when you do that and you step onto the basketball court, you are already putting yourself at a disadvantage because your opponent can sense that you don't even believe in yourself. It all starts with yourself. And that's something that I've learned in life. Everything starts with believing in yourself. If you don't believe you can get it done, guess what? You will not get it done. And that's what I've learned in my life. And I've had to learn the hard way too. So I'm letting you guys know early, you have to believe in yourself. That's my top five ways of becoming good at basketball. Follow me on all social media platforms at DRish TV. I'm doing many of different things on my YouTube channel and I'm going to continue to do them no matter whether the algorithm like it or not. I'm going to try to crack the algorithm, of course, but I'm still going to continue to give you guys things that I've learned in my life so I can help you guys not make the same mistakes that I've made in my life. I'm going to help you out where I can help you out at. I don't know. I don't know at all. I don't know at all. D Rich is still learning. Uh, I don't know at all, but I can tell you some things that can help you improve, man. Subscribe, like the video. It's your boy D Rich TV, man. I'm out.